I want you to know something about Solidity. What is it about the Web3 and the, the blockchain? What is it that people have been getting wrongly about it? Because uh, a wise man once wrote in a book that if the purpose of a thing is not known, abuse is inevitable. And in this series, I want to actually show you or tell you the reason behind these technologies that are available to you in this time that most people are actually getting wrongly and are pursuing it in the wrong you know uh, perspective okay so why because i i noticed that people are having the uh mindset that oh the blockchain is going to phase out you know web3 is going to what be become outdated you know it's not going to be the trend again and all of that should i be in the web3 should i be doing web3 development or not you know you can't be thinking like that thinking like that is <laughs> is not a good way of thinking about this technology this technology called the blockchain and the various use cases of them you know which we and knowing as the web tree is uh is a liberative technology is a technology that frees you from the um censorship the censorship uh, uh mandate that is going all around the world solidity and you know other programming languages that works on the blockchain they are like uh they are money driven when it comes to blockchain it is a money language is the money system is a money that is the primary thing you must know about you know the blockchain is that it is a monetary you know uh, uh technology that brings freedom to all manner of uh censorship all manner of controls all manner of unfairness you know uh privacy issues and privacy concerns it's resolved by the blockchain. So what does this really mean for you? What does it mean, you know, for you as a developer, as someone that is living in a time when uh, free speech is fought against, when, uh, you know, you can make a wrong comment or a comment that is not in line with some financial institution, and then you have your money frozen. What are you going to do with that? You don't have any excuse again because you have the blockchain. The blockchain provides you with uh, the means, the foundation, the platform for you to build technology upon that we perform, you know, monetary, you know, transactions without any form of limitations, without any form of censorship, without you compromising, you know, your identity and all of those things. This is the real value that blockchain and the web tree offers that is on that cannot be contended against it cannot there is, there is no alternative there is no fight back on it so if you're still wondering if the blockchain the web tree is something that you should invest your time in in building your skills and all that i will really tell you that you should go go for it and do it because if you're going to be following trends in learning in choosing what you need to learn because you want to get a job okay um you may not be very rooted in anything okay if you're going to choose the blockchain i want you to choose the blockchain for this reason other than you trying to get a job i want you to choose the blockchain for the the ability that it gives you to create products that cannot be censored to create products that bring solution to the to the upcoming censorship, you know, uh, move that is going to rattle all over the world. Just imagine that, you know, you can every every form of uh, transaction that you do today is going to be traced by your government. And if somebody somewhere doesn't like what you're saying, they're going to just block you out guess your savior in this monetary guess what is going to remain for you what is going to be remaining is just the blockchain because right there nobody knows who you are the only thing that they know is your wallet address and they don't even know if that was your wallet address so you got to know how to do this thing because in the future not too far from now a lot of a, a lot of there will be so much of uh control that will not allow people 
to do a private transactions anymore without them being noticed by some guy, you know, hiding under the shadow, monitoring and watching out for what you say or what you do or all that. And if it doesn't conform to their things, you know, and they, they, they will block you. For you to escape that matrix, for you to escape that evil that is coming, you as a blockchain developer, you as someone that is interested in the, in the blockchain and the web tree, you got to furnish your skill, okay, on how to build different use cases for the web. Different use cases. Because all the applications that you see today, you know, are the big application, the monetary, the web two applications that you see around today, you can build a web three versions of them. And the more you grind your skills in this space, the more you can actually be valuable because many people, we want to offer their customers that privacy, you know, uh, uh, method of them making payments and you'll be the one that they're going to contact to offer such kind of service, to build those next generation applications that will free people or that will give them another alternative of them having a private life on the web. So get yourself ready, sharpen yourself, learn about what the blockchain really is for. Root yourself in it, you know, position yourself and, you know, learn all that you can, apply for jobs, but just know that there's a big move coming which will involve a lot of what censorship programs all there and the solutions to such kind of problems will be you the web tree and the blockchain developer and if you want to learn more about the web tree okay uh we have a website you know check out the description area of this video and check out our resources check out our website our youtube channel and get yourself rounded on the skill I am Darlington Gospel and I just want to tell you the truth.